It's gonna take forever to kill these two. Especially if I fuck it up. sounds when you actually like um, deflect an enemy attack that's it's so cool definitely outdid their jobs there outdid themselves actually that's the way to say it for his fast attacks, right? Hmm. Let's see, maybe I can actually get start getting myself or actually just get myself a Gladius. Or not a Gladius, uh Mine still spot on. I think that they are better than these ones. So these aren't the best ones you can get, I think. So let's move on. is the best, who knows. So let's get that one. Get this one. Wait, wait. Not all of them. One. No, never mind. These are definitely there's more expensive shit, surely. I remember paying like a couple of thousands of thousand, twenty thousand, thirty, forty thousand for a shield and a sword and something like that. Okay, yeah, there we go. the same what's the cost difference though oh god damn it cost difference is huge to say the least expensive gladius let's see Hmm. 
Look at that, 20k for the shield. Actually, don't have money for that. Alright, because I picked up all of them. And I picked up all of these. Types. Look at this. Look at how many helmets there are. Yeah, that looks awful. At least in my opinion. Actually, it seems like that guy doesn't have the. He is with the mask. Okay, let's not go with these. Let's go with the... Uh, which one did I want to go with? Hmm. Isn't there one with green? Now these do offer a bit more like... armor but like five points doesn't matter at this point you know isn't there one with green feathers come on no Let's go with the yellow. Let's see if there's a metal one or ivory. No. the enemy colors I guess we're gonna go with that doesn't look too bad get us half our money Let's see about the chess piece Get the purple one. And you get banned off in the interwebs for that. Don't be surprised. Mm, I don't have the money for that, so let's go with the next best, best thing, All right? Okay, we already have that. And we already have the best boots. Hm. And we have the best horse. We got the best weapons, I just need to pick up uh, like 50 more for the chess piece. Now we have a sh yeah, we have, sh yeah, we, have we have everything. So we're good. Now, hopefully, we go to war with the Western Empire. So we can grab... Maybe like all of this. 
because I don't think I don't think you can yeah you need to go through here to get over this way so like take the central part of it for myself surprised I do wonder is the, is the rebel faction gonna be are they gonna be rain ain't working are they gonna be the you know this the citizens or are they gonna be the normal ones that's the question what I'm gonna do with them Choose to bandits. So freaking annoying. Right, I should do this like check. Whichever settlement has a shitload of troops in it, you can go over there, make a new party with it. starting to get some support to declare war on the western empire good only problem is i do need uh, my god there's so many of them i'm gonna need a lot of influence the marauder increase the party size no it did not Jesus Christ so many bandits Once they actually bring that down, I think we're going to be able to declare war on the Western Empire. And hopefully. Let's see. Uh, four days away. God damn. That's, that is a problem. We're kind of spread out at the moment. Then I'm going to be did Kara pass straight through them. Through the center of the em empires. <laughs> Which is a problem.
Yeah, the... Okay, they're losing troops, so it means they're actually, you know, attacking that. Good. Question is, are they gonna win? Okay, they did. Good. Problem is, it's probably never gonna like stick. It's gonna rebel again, probably. Okay, now let's see about declaring war. It's even worse than before, fuck. Hmm. I see what the problem is. Have a an aggression pack for sixteen more days. I think I'm gonna need to wait it out till we can declare war on on them. Might as well start buying those. It is wool, right? Yeah. Good. Mm, let's actually move up to Zionica, see if it looks like grain over there. Or a baker. Green, yeah, it does. Okay, I hate wheat beer, though. <laughs> I might as well go buy uh, buy the enterprises all all along here. At least, you know, get into a war. We'll find out. I'm not sure if that's gonna uh, be good for us. It's the horses count as leather. 
Or do cows count as leather only? As for Sinope, it looks like beer. the money what never mind i do i can't just i uh, can't have any more enterprises is that it yeah four out of four I think they managed to fix the problem with the like uh, lords having lower tier troops by just you know having a shitload of higher level troops around. Definitely seems like it. That they can recruit. Oh never mind, 33 looters. The next best, best thing. Against 53 of them, we don't lose anyone. But against, like, what? Three of them, we lose everyone? Or a guy? Makes sense, game. Is it playing the same song over and over again? Yes, it is. Going to war, boys. Bad my castles are gonna be the first one on the siege. Most likely. Actually, let's actually gather up an army so we're ready. Let's go for the city first. I don't have more troops in here. Oh, I know what I know what's gonna happen. As soon as I declare war on them and besiege the city, there's gonna be a big fuck off army heading my way. And we do wanna switch to south. And why am I losing cohesion? the other party it got wiped out please follow us in the air god damn it
I'm gonna besiege it once this guy gets out of there. Or declare war and besiege. Come on. Okay, there we go. And run close by. Not really. It's coming, but oh, oh well. <laughs> well, I'm, I'm gonna be surprised if an army doesn't show up or at least besiege one of my settlements in the meantime. Now I get a low. I see why I'm not getting skills in throwing or level ups in throwing. God, can we build any slower? Fuck six. Okay, there we go. See if I can siege this out, this one out completely. <laughs> yeah, good thing it expired now, right? Okay, there we go. Sturgeons. Too bad I don't care about them. I'm not. My land's not on the board with them. Come on, click it. Okay, let's see how long does it take to actually destroy walls with all the perks and everything. What a, quite a while, apparently. Here are the walls to the wall level three, okay? Hopefully they're not gonna attack me now. Come on, destroy the wall. Come on, come on, come on. Throw that catapult, there we go. Not do the bathroom round. Okay, now let's get the archers to do their work. No, 
know where the hell are the breaches. I see only one. Oh, I see. To fucking set them apart, not go run off. Get the infantry over there and get out of here. Oh, that's a bad idea, guys. Go that way, go through the through the walls. Now if I can only get through, that would be nice. That's how it's done. I guess I should have like guys in in the party with the, everything leveled up to the full. Like each of the skill trees, like bottom and top. I should have done that. We deal in headshots only, boys. Look at that.
Now, hopefully I'm going to be able to grab a couple of more settlements with this army, but um, I think they should gather up, but the enemy should gather up by th at this point, right? Let's grab all this. I need the money. Party that was on me eat all the food? What? And we did. For the army, not the party. Uh, what do I want to do? We need to find someone to place in here, that's right. Question is who is in the party? Or actually, let's yeah, let's go through through the list. limit we are from battles Siege engines to a chance. Damage tools, no. You know, let's see who can we leave in here. It's gonna help. Horseman, the surgeon, the marauder, and the swordsman don't touch him. That's the guy we made a uh, made a party with, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, let's, let's switch this around. Yeah, copy to all castles, copy to all towns, and what do I want to do? Right, smithing guild. Let's see if I can grab myself the chest piece. Now we're fully kitted out. 
Oh god damn, why didn't we spawn closer to them? We can grab them all. No, the thing is, as soon as we leave here, someone's gonna besiege it. Maybe not. We definitely need to buy food, though. Yeah, there we go. We need to go back. Thing that uh, the enemy can like just spawn siege equipment instantly so to take it <laughs> that would be that would suck ass or like take siege equipment with them i guess since this is a sure win i'm not gonna fight it Doofy is the loyals in here. No shit game. He's the governor. Hopefully I'm gonna get over there and this is not gonna be get besieged in the meantime. through the mountains. Question is which one is on me? Um, I'm gonna guess he's someone who's not in the party. He's somewhere else. to replenish our troops to say the least. There's probably gonna be more of them over there. 
And where the hell are our armies? Not close enough. never tell when they're actually fighting or not. Which is freaking annoying. Actually, go sit in a castle for a second. To go off after the bastards. Hopefully we can besiege this while it does, didn't get any reinforcements in. Capture it again. Yeah, they only, only have 150. Now I'm just going to send the troops in. I'm not going to bother fighting it again. Actually, let's fight it without any siege equipment. Hopefully, our guys are gonna go up the ladders and not just sit by them. Or the walls are actually breached, so that works out too. Well, one of one one wall is breached. I'm actually pretty surprised that the bows don't do more damage to me. I mean, I do have the best armor in the game, but still, like, it's piercing, right?
And as I say, I don't take any damage. I get, what was it, 46 piercing damage to the head? Yeah, there we go. Thing. Good. Okay, now the span the army. Sit here for a while. <laughs> or maybe just go try and recruit some stuff around here. If I could click the leave button. Or I can just pick up recruits from here, right? Again, the merciful trait. Generous, honest, and merciful. There we go, a full army. Again. Okay, now. Hopefully we can hold on to this. Why would fucking damn it game? Don't attack them. You now go attack them. I'm actually gonna fight this one. Let me just switch the weapons. Hosta and the Gladius. allies are gonna do since there is a decent amount of them Oh, 
Like why do they why does a couple of infantrymen get so fast up there and there's are the commanders who are super fast apparently. charge us at some point, right? I wish they spread out a little bit more, God, uh, like, why do they bunch up so much? does nothing again. Why do I even bother with the cavalry? I, I don't freaking know at this point. Easy peasy. Stewardship, leadership, and engineering. But remember. The shark. The shark guy. Troops under your command have their projectile speed increased by 10%. Proje projectile speed if you're throwing weapons, weapons increased by 25%. On troops, yeah. Let's go. F okay, there he is. Second day, I thought he vanished. one here so next time I'm like wondering how much am I gonna take I mean the problem is if I take this I'm gonna wanna take this 
once I take that, I'm gonna wanna take these too. Hmm. You know what? Well, the better idea is to let's see one, two, three cities, three castles. Yeah, maybe take this. And then take all of this too, but just give it to someone else, no, so I don't actually command it. That would be the better idea. So I don't have to manage it or defend it. Because this would this is gonna be enough to like finance everything, the, the, the stuff I have already, more or less. Just this, I'll just get this as a bonus, and then I'm gonna be fine. Maybe like get this once we actually go to war with. The Southern Empire again. Yeah, so we grab all of this area here. So we're nice and in the nice slab dab in the middle in the middle of the map. I don't have to deal with the enemies raiding me all the time. Well, hopefully, unless it's the Southern Empire and the Northern em the Western Empire, of course. So guys, you for watching. Have a good morning, good day, good night. See you next time.